Hello, hello everyone, and welcome back to Thrifting Thursdays. This is Nancy, and I apologize for my voice. I have a little head cold or allergies or something going on, but uh, let's get right to what I picked up for this week's Thrifting Thursday. So the first thing that I wanna talk about are these books. <clears throat> these books are paperback books. They were each 99 cents, so I paid a total of $2.97 for them. I knew, it, the reason that I bought all three is because it's, it's just a book that I want to read that I'm actually interested in. And I knew that Above Mackinac probably um, was a fairly expensive book because I follow a Mackinac Island group on Facebook and this is an island in Michigan, if you are aware of this. But this particular book right now is selling for $24 on uh, Amazon. The Charleston uh, Historical Homes book is selling for $5.39 on Goodreads. And the Somerton Women is selling for $8.19 on uh, Amazon. So next we'll move to these little slipper socks. Um, as you can see, I paid $1.99 for these. These are new, still in, uh, still in, never worn, brand new condition. And retail, those are, let me see, $24. So this is an item that I was really excited to find. So, uh, number one, they're GE outdoor lights, commercial grade quality, and then it goes on to say that if one bulb goes out, the rest stay on. So I was particularly interested in that. I got three boxes. I paid two dollars and twenty nine cents a box. Now these are older uh, bulbs, but I had the lady at Goodwill everything that I bought that was. Um, that needed to be plugged up to see if they work. I checked everything. She was very gracious, plugged everything up for me. All three boxes of bulbs work, and the only place I could find these is on a resale um, store called Macari. And to have purchased these three boxes off of Macari, it would have been, let me look it up, 89.64. I paid six eighty seven for three. So, and the you know when I do pick up items, I do have a reason for wanting these. I want to do an outdoor kitchen at my dad's uh, house this year, and so I'll use these to string around for light. So, pretty happy about that. The next thing I wanted to show you is this tea fowl. We can find the name T Fowl Skillet. Okay, so the very first thing when I picked it up, it's getting heavy, but it's also a little wobbly. But you know what? That doesn't bother me because all you need to do is take a screwdriver and tighten it up right there. And then the second thing that's going against it is this. This will come off with Barkeeper's Friend. I've showed you that before in previous. Um, videos. This is an 11 inch skillet. This brand is actually made in France. Picked it up for $2.59 and it retails for let's see $32.99. $32.99. So moving around the table I picked up this Yankee Candle. Never been lit. It uh, and it is more of a winter scent, but I actually like this. I paid $2.99, retails for $15. The next thing that I picked up, I found this, uh, this really cute, uh, oops, get out of the light there, uh, light for the kitchen for $2.59, and I do carry, don't laugh, but I do carry um, a battery with me so I can put it in and uh, make sure that this works. And this retails for $15. 
but you know I, I do keep things like um, a battery tape measures different things like that and then you can always look things up on your phone so the next item that I found were these decorative shower hooks and I thought those were so pretty this is spring made they're new they've never been opened and let's see I paid $2.29 for these and I found them, let's look, I found them for $19.99 on eBay. So, um, but I was just so pretty to find these because I think these were so decorative. The next thing that I found was this lamp, beautiful lamp. Of course, I plugged it in. Um, there's no markings but you know i looked it over it's an absolutely wonderful condition when you turn it over and you see the little felt pads on the bottom you know that this is a quality uh lamp so i paid 6.99 for that i do have to have a shade but it does have the finial so that always make sure you have the finial if you have this type of um of anchor the for the lampshade and i'm going to value this at 50 dollars. so the last item that i'll show you is this hamilton beach microwave look like it had really had hardly any use to it again i plugged it up everything works on it I paid $34.99 for that, and it retails for $118. Let's see, yeah, I showed you the rollers. I think I've showed you everything. So my total bill for this, um, this transaction was $76. And when I went and totaled up everything that I had purchased and to put a retail price on it, it would have cost me $457.19. And I only did that because it's always, uh, it's always kind of interesting and exciting to me to see what things are worth that, that you just walk into a Goodwill and, and you're able to find, you know, things that, that you can use and Oftentimes, things that you need if you're doing a project, you know, think ahead and kind of be on the lookout for different things. But um, I hope you've enjoyed this video. And on Sunday, I'm working on a video for jobs that we should be doing in our garden in February because it's not going to be long before spring will be here. I think 56 days, maybe 55 days, something like that. And we're going to be ready for, uh, for flowers and vegetables and all those fun things. So um, I hope that you'll uh, look out for that video. And if you don't care, please hit the like, share, and subscribe button. That helps me out to grow my channel. I hope you've enjoyed this video, and I will see you Sunday.